So, Fall Guys. Chances are you've heard of it. And if you haven't, seriously, what kind of rock have you been living under? I mean, seriously, this game has taken up every single space in my recommended box, both on YouTube and on Twitch. So, if you've heard of it, you've probably also played it, or watched someone else play it. So in that time of playing, you've probably thought to yourself, oh, it would be cool to have private lobbies in this game. Well, uh, no. Today I'm gonna tell you how private lobbies will ruin Fall Guys. So, let's get started. When you get into a lobby in Fall Guys, you get paired up with 59 other people. These people are probably about the same skill level as you if you have played the game a little bit. And that's our first problem. If custom lobbies were to be announced, every streamer and sweat would practice there for hours before joining a real match. Take Fortnite for example. Before Season 4 and the introduction of Playground mode, no one really knew how to build that well and everyone was almost at similar skill levels. But shortly after the introduction of Playground mode, anyone who didn't have hours to spend on playground mode just wasn't at the same skill level anymore as those who did. Okay, back to Fall Guys now. So imagine this, you've just got the game and you're about to jump into your first match. Heck, you could even have played for a little while but you only play with your friends so you jump on to play with them. You get in the game, uh, let's say the level is Whirligig. You, someone who hasn't practiced in private lobbies, go run the course normally. But when you've run for a while, you start to notice that the qualification count rapidly goes up. This is because of players who have practiced and players who know exactly what to do and every skill and cheat in the book. Okay, so let's say you make it to the final of this same lobby where a lot of players have practiced the courses. You think this is your chance to win. Wrong. If private lobbies were introduced, what rounds do you think people would practice the most? Perfect match? No, of course not. They would practice the heck out of the final rounds. So you, a new player, would be criminally outmatched in those final rounds. So what do you do? You practice in custom lobbies until you get better and better. And this circle creates a huge skill cap, even in a game as simple as Fall Guys. Think about that for a while. And that's why custom lobbies would ruin Fall Guys. Anyways, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe if you are new. If you have, I will see you in the next episode. But until then... Peace.